Welcome back to Learning Inkscape and this time I'm going to show you how to color the default pad. So this is basically part 2 of a video that I made 2 days ago. Let us create a circle, a rectangle and a star and I'll add the default patterns. If you want to know more about that, go to the first video, I'll link to it in the description below. But under object, fill and stroke, you will find the patterns right here. But you can see the star was red and if I add a pattern, it's automatically turned black as this is the default color of the pattern and it doesn't matter if I change the fill it'll always replace the pattern so the stripes vanish and let me add a checkerboard here to the third element I've got the star selected I go to filters then color and duochrome so this is the best way to color them let me check the live preview. Color 1 is important here as color 2 is transparent. So if I change it, then uncheck and recheck the live preview, the new color is applied. And under options, you can play around with the fluorescence. It's minor adjustment. So use this filter duochrome to color them and afterwards apply it. Don't forget that. I'll add it to the checkerboard, so the rectangle right here. And it's the same procedure. So color 1 is the one that determines the color of these black squares. Let me choose a pattern that has more than one color, for example this camouflage right here. And once again it's selected, filters, do chrome. Check the live preview and now we can also adjust color 2. And again, don't forget to apply it afterwards. And this is one way to recolor these default patterns in Inkscape. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.